You know, the summer warmer temperatures killed thousands of sockeye salmon in Idaho's rivers. Chris Martinez shows us the unusual steps being taken to save the sockeye from extinction. Rivers in Idaho, once filled with sockeye salmon, are now mostly empty. The fish are struggling to survive in water that's too warm from the extreme heat and drought. You start getting over 72 degrees, you start losing fish. And we had temperatures above 74 degrees at times. Biologist Russ Kiefer is part of a team that's been working to repopulate the declining species in Idaho for years. But this summer was a major setback. Kiefer estimates up to 90% of the salmon returning from the Pacific Ocean to Idaho to spawn did not survive. I can't imagine anything worse than this year. Officials declared a fish emergency, taking drastic measures to save the species. Teams trapped migrating adults in the wild, then loaded the fish onto trucks and moved them to this hatchery. They were able to capture just 51 fish mid-journey. Nearly 50 others survived the entire swim back on their own and were also taken to the hatchery. It's far less than expected. Ideally, we would have had several thousand. Had we not stepped in to try and prevent the extinction of the stock, they, they would be gone today. While scientists have been able to save the sockeye for now, they don't know how long they'll be able to keep them going if this summer's heat and drought become the new normal. Chris Martinez, CBS News, Boise. Idaho Fish and Game workers say they're also pumping cold water from reservoirs to cool the rivers.